A man is dead and a Milwaukee police officer on administrative duty after a police chase ended in a fatal shooting. Police say right around 1.40 this afternoon, officers stopped a car with no license plates near 70th and Thurston in Milwaukee. The chief says the driver sped off and officers chased him. Chief Jeffrey Norman says the driver then ran a red light at 91st and Silver Spring, crashing into another car. And that's when police say the driver took off running with a gun in hand. The chief says an officer running after him ordered the man to drop his gun multiple times, then shot him. And this is where we bring in 12 News' Caroline Reinwald. And Caroline, you've obtained new cell phone video showing the minutes after the shooting. Right, Joyce. A viewer shared that video with us asking to remain anonymous. We are blurring and pausing parts of the video because of how graphic it is. That video showing officers slowly making their way with guns drawn behind a protective shield to the man who was face down motionless on the ground after an officer shot him. Now, after pausing the video, it does show police drag the man by one foot deeper into a BP gas station parking lot at one point picking him up by the back of his pants and hands. The Milwaukee Police Department is responding tonight, issuing a statement saying it is aware of videos circulating on social media platforms. Spokesperson goes on to say MPD is conducting a full administrative investigation of this incident. MPD holds its members to the highest level of integrity, and if it is determined that any member has violated the code of conduct, they will be held accountable. Chief Jeffrey Norman spoke to reporters earlier tonight. Did the suspect point the gun at the officers who were chasing him at any point? At this time is unknown. I know that uh, at the time that the uh, officer engaged, there was a firearm, but at what point and where, how, that's still you know, part of the investigation. And Caroline, we do know the chief went on to say that no officers were injured during the shooting. Right, and the woman the driver struck refused medical treatment on the scene. It is unclear at this point if any police rendered aid to the 31-year-old Milwaukee man they shot. Caroline Reinwald reporting live from the newsroom tonight.